In this video, we're going to talk about how to highlight a particular box that was filled out in error. And in this case, we're going to provide focus to the first text box, and that is the name text box. So what we want to do is if the user fills it out incorrectly, we want that box to be highlighted in red with a red border. And I'll show you that in a minute. Now the method that we need to use is the focus method. And so that's what we're going to do. Now where to put that? Well, the good place to do that is after the alert. So after the user clicks OK to the alert box, then we will provide focus to the element that was in error. In this case, of course, it is the input element with name, our name text box. So first thing we need to do is go right here and we're just going to call our box object and we're just going to call the focus method. And so what this does is it just provides focus back to our box element right here. It'll just highlight it. But that in itself won't do a lot. Now that we've called this, we want to provide a little styling with that red border. So I'll just copy and paste the line of code I have. And here it is. We're calling our box object. We're using the style object. And then we're using the border property and then we just specify solid 3px red. Most of you will have recognized that by now. And so if this works correctly, if they fill out this text box wrong, this of course will be true and this code will be executed. Only this time, focus will be provided back to the element and we will highlight it with a red border. Now I do want to point out before we run this, we're only going to cover this outcome right here. This outcome where it's true they filled out the first text box wrong and they filled out the second one correctly. We will talk about how to provide focus to multiple elements in another video. So let's go ahead and save everything up and let's go ahead and submit our page in Chrome. And so what we're going to do is we're going to fill out the first text box wrong again. So we'll only enter three characters like we did in the last video. The second text box, that'll be false. They entered everything correctly. Let's hit submit. We got our alert. Now if we hit OK, that first text box should be highlighted red. And it is. Take a look at that. And so the user knows right away they have to refill this out correctly. And if we hit submit, the form is submitted. OK, that's going to do it for this video.